here. So I am just getting back from watching The Chosen. What did I think? I hated the ending. I'm not going to tell you what happened because I don't want to give it away. But go see it. It's really, really good. Um, one of the things I did take away, me and my son went over and watched and some guy was handing out um, keychains with the cross, The Chosen. If you want to see my other video coming, I will show you a picture if anybody wants to order one I will let him know or give you information or whatever so um, one of the things I got from this is I love how the chosen just you know brings the Bible alive in so many ways and I'm not saying I agree with all the interpretation of it but I do appreciate what I can get out of it and um, one of the things I loved with this scene was um, the bringing of John the Baptist to life. Uh, they did a great job with this. There were scenes where I hadn't really thought about John the, John the Baptist much. I think my um, kind of learning of John was kind of, you know, he's just this weirdo in the wilderness who ate locusts, some wild crazy man. That's kind of, I don't know if it was a, like, kind of the Sunday school version of John the Baptist or what but when you think of John the Baptist holy cow you know he um he's just cream of the crop up there with Christ I mean they were cousins obviously but the chosen did a good story on you know how when he was um the fruit of the womb of Elizabeth how you know, some of the thoughts that might have been happening at the time. Um, John came to proclaim Christ. He came to show that Jesus was the way. That's all. I don't want to say that's all, but that is what the main purpose of his life was, was to proclaim the Christ. And, I mean, can you imagine, besides Jesus having a mission for his life, uh, John also had a mission and uh, uh, the, the saddest part about it that I actually cried was when he was beheaded. Beheaded. Uh, it was so evil what they did to John the Baptist. It was so, so evil. I mean, this, this movie does a really good job portraying how evil indeed um, people can be. I mean, just the pride of life. Uh, this this Herodias was offended by what he had said and therefore she wanted John's life and um, just so sad you know John was so innocent and did nothing wrong nothing at all and they killed him they beheaded him and it's just amazing to think of somebody willing to do that for their faith and we know later, like Peter, you know, and others had died for their faith, but just just um, an amazing faith builder. And I know for me, that's going to make me go back to the Bible and really get a start studying, you know, the life of John and an amazing, you know, man he was. So go see The Chosen. Great movie.